Abdul guys, it's your host Wasim with Muhammad Niazi and Danish Abdul. And today we will take a deep dive into smallpox and the first vaccine. So let's roll the intro. has made it official smallpox throughout the world has been virtually eliminated smallpox is thought to have originated nearly 3000 years ago in either egypt or india the earliest evidence of the smallpox comes from the egyptian pharaoh Ramesses v who died in 1157 bc it is estimated that around 300 million to a half a billion people have died due to smallpox. Moreover, smallpox wiped out one third of the population of Japan. So now you know the history of smallpox, let me tell you what smallpox is. Simply, there are two types of smallpox, variola minor and variola major. Both types are caused by the infection with the variola virus that can be transmitted directly from person to person or through the contact with contaminated items like clothing and bedding. Now you know what smallpox is, let's talk about the symptoms of smallpox. The first symptoms of smallpox include a high fever fatigue, a headache, and a backache. After two to three days of illness, a flat red rash appears. It usually starts on the face and upper arms, and then it spreads all over your body. Now if you are someone who has health issues, please don't. I repeat, do not look at the upcoming picture of the scars. Because due to this picture, I almost vomited twice while researching. The picture is coming. In three, two, and one. Now, let's talk about how the virus attacks the human body. Smallpox originate attacks on multiple organs in the victim's body, but the attack on the immune system is the most destructive one. The victim dies because a virus cripples the immune system by attacking the molecule which block viral replication. After getting the fever, the victim dies within 6 days. As you know, the virus took almost 300 million to 500 million lives, therefore variola minor has a mortality rate of 1% and variola major has a mortality rate of 30%. All this misery ended when an English physician called Edward Jenner created a smallpox vaccine, world's first vaccine. Jenner believed that people who caught a disease called cowpox seemed to have built immunity against smallpox. On May 14, 1796, Jenner took fluid from a cowpox blister and scratched it into the skin of James Phipps, an 18 year old boy. A single blister rose up on the spot, but James soon recovered. On July 1st, Jenner inoculated the boy again, this time with smallpox matter, and no disease developed. This vaccine was a big success. This discovery saved more lives than the work of any other human. Hence, Edward Jenner got the title of the father of immunology. Since smallpox only infects humans, once the human population got vaccinated, the virus wiped out. Correspondingly, the death rate caused by the smallpox also decreased rapidly in 27 years. In 1980, smallpox was officially eradicated. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If so, then please give us full mark. And, and, I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace.